when you are looking at not just a cold case, but a frozen case, evidence is gone, people are dead, to have access to this living eyewitness almost 70 years later, that's huge. We would right. like to ask him some questions about the history you know of the German community here. He's got a big story. Standing lines. Drill, military drill. Okay. Were the teachers in the school supportive of the Nazis? Did they fly the swastika flag at the school? Yes. They did fly it. I have one more question. I want to push a little bit here. Was he part of the Hitler Youth? Era parte de la juventud de Hitler? I never even imagined that I would come and talk to people about something that occurred 70 years ago, and I would see anxiety, reservation, fear, but that's how it is. Look, can't force him to tell us. Okay, we're done. We know, yes, there were Nazi sympathizers here. Thank you Sir. very much. Muchas gracias. Yes, there were Nazi activities at the school. Is there ability in the area to build a significant underground Facility? We're about to find out. There's not sufficient evidence that Hitler died in the bunker in April 30th, 1945. Could Adolf Hitler have gotten out of Berlin and how did he do it? How did he enter Argentina? We're gonna look at who could facilitate hiding Hitler. <laughs> 